Nuno, wow. Um, I'm guessing this is the biggest win of your career, but what just happened? Honestly, I, I, I still can't believe it. Um, what a match, yeah. Like, I never expected to be here in, well, second week of Australian Open. Who would have thought? At what point in that match did you believe that you were going to get through? Because it, you know, it was ebbing and flowing each side. It was maybe in the third set when I got a break on the third set, and then I was like, "Holy crap! I can maybe maybe I can actually win this." And yeah, it wasn't from the start. I mean, it's like uh, it's like people say: take one set at a time, one game at a time, one service game, stay in the game. Uh, kept pushing through, testing my limits, testing his. Uh, you know, I know a tennis match, anything can happen, and I think today was just a, a true example of that. Absolutely. <laughs> you stay so calm throughout. Usually you see tennis, but when a match is like that happening, you, there's a bit of interaction with the coach's box. There was a guy in the pink over there who every time you went to get a towel, it was like his head was about to explode. He was that excited. He was so behind you, but you gave him nothing back. <laughs> was, was something sinking in for you, though? I think it's just, just uh, me staying focused in the match. I try not to care. To, you know, this crowd, this atmosphere can be, can be pretty overwhelming. So I thank you guys for that, too. In a good way, of course. Uh, makes this match so special. I, I don't think I've ever played in front of so many people. Uh, and uh, yeah, what a win. This guy's been a constant support on my side since day one, first match. Uh, I gotta thank my team, obviously, and all the Portuguese people who are out there bringing in the flags. It's been awesome. Last one, mate. Um, I read that you absolutely hate losing. There's, there's disliking losing, you hate losing. Like sometimes you'd go days without talking to people after you lost, like badminton and things like that. But does it go the other way when you win? Do you go berserk when you win and just celebrate like crazy or you're at a grand slam, you've got to knuckle down? I think tennis gives you confidence with wins but it doesn't really last long. You've got to move on and be ready for the next one and you've got to test yourself every time. Every time you have to prove yourself on court. So yeah, I wouldn't say I take days to get over a loss. I, I think I've gotten better with that but I still, I still struggle with it, yeah. Well mate, it's middle Saturday at the Open so if you do want to party, Right over the back there, you probably heard the music all through the match. Well done. Outstanding performance. Nuno Borges, everyone.